Uh, as far as a, a direct response as to an initiator for education or a leading thought or philosophy, I, I think my personal experience has been it's been very, very diverse. Uh, I can point to a number of role models that, that I've either modeled, followed, respected, valued, and I would have directed myself towards those pursuits, utilized them as, as figures that I would you know, typically aspire to or, or guide my life. Uh, some of them are authors, some of them are well-known authors. Uh, Ayn Rand, for example, uh, you know, and objectivism is something that I found compelling. Uh, may not have buy, bought into it hook, line, and sinker, but I was inspired by a lot of the thinking of individualism, the rights of the individual, and so forth, and it created awareness. Um, on a more human level, I can sit down and say, uh, friends, uh, uh, my father, uh, the men in my life uh, that, that have been direct roles that, that you have a personal connection with that have influenced you, friends, peer groups. Uh, in, interestingly enough, you know, I can sit down and say it's not necessarily someone always older. Uh, in many cases, and, and, and Anthony and you in particular, you're, you're younger than I am, but it's been an inspiration watching you take the 21 convention and mount that forward. And it, by your example, it motivates you to do similar things. And we f fail, fail to recognize often that our own example is a very, very powerful motiv motivator for change in the world. And I know I've always looked directly to others to find different elements, to find inspiration, to find a measure of a connection, and to be inspired by that. And so I look for any number of ways. Uh, I joke that I'm, I'm a professional thief, that I constantly try to steal everything I can from everywhere. Uh, but you try to make it your own, uh, and not just mimic. But in many cases, if you can follow in somebody else's footsteps, it's a lot easier than trailblazing. And it, even when you are trailblazing, you can use others by direct example. What did they do? How were they inspired? And you get to understand them in a, in a manner you probably wouldn't recognize. And that's been kind of an interesting story when I view my early childhood development with my father, uh, my idealized version of him, and then when I, as a teenager, start recognizing him as a man, uh, his personal failings and the failings between him and I, and the growing issues that happen. And of course, I'm trying to self-identify and develop my own sense of identity in my own, my own life. And then to recognize that in a very real way, he was a man and he was trying and that he may not have known, but I was also realized the humanity that is in, uh, embedded within the individual. And that has been a tremendous learning experience. And then it's also brought me closer to him to understand truly the man that is my father and not just this idealized self. Uh, and that's, that's been an immense uh, motivator and, and, and something I can add, utilize as a touchstone for my own personal growth. And uh, it's, it's, I've always tended to use personal examples along those ways.